بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته شابتر 8 Product, Service and Brands Product, Service and Brands Building Customer Value Now we are speaking about product, the first element of marketing mix What's product? It's anything that can be offered in a market for attention, acquisition, use, or consumption that might satisfy a need or want. Anything we offer in a market that might satisfy a need or want. There is no pure product or a pure service where I am saying a package market offering, market offering. What about the levels of a product and service? There are three levels. A core customer value or a core product, actual level, actual product, augmented product, the served level, augmented product. What's core customer value? It's the main function of a product. It's what's our way buying. It's okay. What's actual? We turn a core into actual. What's augmented? It's additional benefits to our customer. What's the core customer value? Product planners need to think about products and services on three levels. Each level adds more customer value. The most basic level is the core customer value, which addresses the question what is the buyer? We buying. When designing products, marketing must first define the core, I mean problem solving benefits of service that a customer seek. At the second level, actual product, product planners must must turn the core benefits into an actual product. They need to develop product and service features, design, quality, level, and the brand name and the pack packaging. Finally, product planners must build an augmented product around the core benefits and the actual product by offering additional consumer services and benefits. Subject to product classification. Where we we speak about just we speaking about consumer products. We classify consumer products into four types: convenience, shopping, specialty, and unsold. Convenience product, it's consumer products and services that the consumer usually buys frequently, immediately and with the minimum comparison and buying effort, like newspaper, magazines, candy, fast food. Second type of product, it's a shopping products, consumer products and services that the customer compares carefully on suitability, quality, price and the style, like furniture, cars and appliances. Spe specialty products served Product type, consumer product and service with the unique characteristics or brand identification for which a significant group of buyers is willing to make a special effort, special purchasing effort, like medical services, designer clothes, and the high end electronics. And the finally, unsold products, consumer products that the customer doesn't know about or knows about but doesn't normally think of buying like life insurance and the blood donation. This is uh, product types. When I'm speaking about consumer buying behavior, convenience product, frequent purchase with little planning, shopping, less frequent purchase, much planning and the much purchasing effort. Speciality, stronger brand preferences, and the loyalty, special purchase effort. Price, 
convenience low price shopping high price higher price speciality high price distribution intensive distribution or widespread distribution selective distribution for the shopping products and exclusive distribution in specialty products promotion mass promotion shopping advertising and personal selling specialty more carefully targeted promotion by post producer and resellers product and the service decision we decide we take a decision related to our product at three levels individual product and product line and the product mix decision individual product and service decision product attribute branding packaging and delivering Oh, starting with the product and service attribute. When we speak about product attribute, we speak about quality, feature, style, and design. Quality means freedom from the facts. Feature, it's a competitive tool for differentiating a product from a competitor's product. And the product style and design, style describes the appearance of the product. It can be eye-catching, but design contributes to a product's usefulness as well as its use. It means that design is the larger concept than style. Brand. Brand, it's a name, Nessia. Term, pure life. Sign or design or a combination of these that identify the maker or seller of a product or a service. Brand, brand name becomes the base on which a whole marketing story can be built about the product. Three, packaging involve designing and producing the container or wallpaper for a product. The main or the primary function of a package was to hold and protect the product, the core customer value. Labeling, identify the product or brand, describe attributes and provide promotion. A label function, one, identify the product or brand, two, describes several things about the product, and finally promotes the brand. Product AI decision. What's product AI? Product AI is a product, is a group of products that are closely related because they function in a similar manner, are sold to the uh, same customer group are marketed through the same type of outlets or free within a given price range. What's what's product line ends? Product line ends. It's uh, the number of items in the product line. What is the type of decision can we take related to the product line? Product line filling involves adding more items within the present range of the line for extra profit, uh, satisfying dealers using access capacity, belonging holes to keep uh, out competitors. The other decision, it's uh, product line stretching occurs when a company lances its product line beyond its current range. Companies located at the upper end of the market can stretch their line downward. Companies located at the lower end of the market can stretch their product lines upward. Add prestige to their current products. Companies located in the middle range of the market can stretch their line 
in both directions, it's two directions stretching. Product max decision. What's product max? It's a product portfolio consists of all the product sign and items that a particular seller offers for sale. What's product max wets? Product max wets refer to the number of different product lines the company carries. What's product max lens refer to the total number of items the company carries within its product line. What's product max depths refers to the number of various offers of each product in the line. And finally, what's product mix, con mix consistency refers to how closely related the various product line are in end use production requirements, distribution channels, or some other way. Service. Service have gross or grown dramatically in the recent years. It is a product with a different or a, a nature or characteristics. Intangibility, insuperability, variability, appreciability. What's intangibility? Uh, service intangibility means that service cannot be seen, tested, fit, heard, or smelled before they are bought, before purchasing. What service in superability mean that service cannot be separated from their provider, whether the providers are people or machines? What service variability mean that the quality of a service depends on who provides them as well as when, where, and how they are provided? And finally, service appreciability mean that service cannot be stored or later for a later sale or use. New subject, brand strategy, building strong brand. What's brand equi equity? The, differenti the differentiated effect that knowing the brand name has on customer response to the product or its marketing. What's brand strat branding strategy, building strong brands. Brands are more than just names or symbols. They, they are a key element in the company's relationship with customer. Brands represent consumer perception and the feeling about a product and its performance. Everything that the product or the service means to customer. So brands are created in the customer mind while our products are created in the factory. Brand building strong brands. We will speak about brand positioning, brand name selection, brand sponsorship, and the final brand development. Brand positioning like market offering positioning. Brand strategy decision include brand attributes, brand benefits, product attributes, product benefits, and product behavior and values. As we, as we uh, arrange or position our market offering, in a customer mind, we also position our brand in a customer mind based on product attributes, product benefits, and the product beliefs and values. Brand name selection. To select a right or a good brand for your, your, your product, 
you should consider a conditions for this selection. The brand name should suggest benefits and qualities, easy to pronounce, easy to recognize, easy to remember, distinctive, extendable, translatable for a global economy, capable for registration and legal protection. Brand sponsorship. There are four types of brand sponsorship. Manufacturer brand, it means a manufacturer brand. Private brand, it means uh, we can sell our brand regardless we will say our company or not. Licensed brand means that company will license for another company to use its a brand name or a know-how or technology, whatever. Co-brand means that one product can carry two types of brand from a different companies. Brand development strategy. To develop a brand strategy, we use a two dimension, brand name and product category. Brand name existing or new, and the product it is exists existing or new. To use existing with existing, it's an extension. Existing a brand or new product brand extension. Existing product to name your product brand, it's mighty brand, new is new, I mean new brand with a new product, it's new brand. Line extension occur when a company extended existing brand names to new forms, color, size, whatever. Brand extension. Extend a current brand name to a new or modified products in a new category. Mighty brands. Companies over market my many, many different brands in a given product category. Introduces additional brands in the same category, PNG. And the finally, a uh, new brand. A company might believe that the power of its uh, existing brand name is uh, is not that much going well, and a new brand name is needed. Or when it enters a new product category, for which the company current brand name are approved. So our the company will will we introduce or will produce a new product with a new brand. Product life cycle strategies. The product pass uh, five stages, product development and introduction. When, when we enter our product into the market, gross, maturity and finally decline. Product development, investment, introduction, gloss, maturity, and the client. And this is uh, a types of a of a product life cycle. Style, fashion, fat. Introduction stage. Sale says gloss, yet they or no profit high distribution expenses and promotion expenses. Gross stage, sales increase, no, now competitors enter the market. Price stability or decline to increase sales volume. Consumer education, profits increase, promotion, Promotion and the manufacturing costs gain economics of scale. Maturity, everything slow down. Slow down in sales, many suppliers substitute products. Overcapacity leads to competition, increased promotion, and R&D to support sales 
and profits and and finally the client stage <sighs> maintaining the product or harvest or develop depends on how we evaluate our product potential in a decline stage the sales of most product forms and brands dropped the decline may be slow or uh, falling down i mean more aggressive uh, trend downtrend Thank you, my student. This is our chapter eight, product and service. Thank you, and see you next chapter, inshallah.